Hello and welcome to this afternoon's coverage of Sirencester vs Chippenham Town. The games keep coming thick and fast for the Bluebirds who are defeated 2-1 by Newport last time out, but today's clash provides another opportunity for young players to be introduced and make their mark upon the first team. Might be a chance to get in behind the defence here. Dan Griffiths burning past his man, weaving his way into the box and putting it on a plate for the number 11, who tucks it in from close range. Chippenham open the scoring here. The trial is wearing the number 11 shirt, puts it into the back of the net, but credit must go to Griffiths. He created that goal with a fantastic driving run into the box and unselfishly squared into the middle where the trialist puts it home and Chippenham have the breakthrough. A team goal, well created and well finished inside the box. Brief spell of possession here for the home side, just working it into midfield. The big striker, number nine, dropping deep to receive the pass. Blocked there by the referee, in fact, but they get a second chance here, building down the right-hand side. Number two, bringing the ball into midfield. Looking to thread a ball down the right-hand side again, but well defended back there. Second lofted ball is well held up from the number nine. Very well held up. Number ten with a chance to drive one into the box across the face of goal. Another shooting opportunity at the back post. Well saved by Will Henry, who denies Siren Sester a leveller here. Again working their way into midfield. But the Chippenham pressure means they've had to be pushed back towards the halfway line. Long ball comes to nothing in the end, but that's the... Most positive piece of play from the home side so far. A well-worked move down the right-hand side. Getting in behind the Bluebirds. And the eventual cross wasn't too far away from meeting the striker. Here goes Alfie Santos driving at the Sirencester defence and offloading the ball. Just at the right moment. Looking for the foul, in fact, but the referee waves play on. Chippenham with a loose pass in the end. Striker for Sirencester looks for the foul on the halfway line, but it's not given. And now the referee does signal and awards a Chippenham free kick, much to the annoyance of the home side. Couple robust challenges going in there. Free kick here for Chippenham. Alfie Santos to take up and over the wall and not far off, in fact. A long way out. Well, the Sirencester goalkeeper watched it all the way. He seemed pretty comfortable, but it wasn't too far off looping into the top corner. Speculative effort. But we've seen what Alfie Santos is capable of last week with a sensational solo goal. He's clearly feeling confident this afternoon. Siren Sester looked to weave one into midfield, but calmly dealt with back there from some of the more experienced Bluebirds. Parcel. Looking to mount a chip and an attack. Oh, it's lovely, neat interchange there. Santos involved at the heart of it. Crossing opportunity towards the back post and converted for number two. And it's the same player that got the first goal. He's on trial and it's turning into a dream afternoon for him. Beautifully well worked chip and a move. Lovely, concise passing and the eventual lofted ball towards the back post. Unmarked. Not a Sirencester defender in sight and on the half volley giving the goalkeeper no chance. High into the top corner and he's got his second of the afternoon. Chippenham's second on away soil and they have a comfortable two goal buffer now and it looks a long way back for the home side. Chippenham in control and starting to have fun with it. Nice little through ball from Alfie Santos. Chance to get a shot away, maybe. He looks for the cut back. No, a cop in and he converts it. He finds the bottom corner, the academy number 18. Cool, muted celebrations, but he'll be delighted with that one. 
He's got on the score sheet. He's got Chippenham's third. Again, no chance for the home side goalkeeper. It's well worked. The cutback perfectly weighted. And Coppin in the box. Penalty box. Predator slots it into the bottom corner. Lovely Chippenham team goal again. There's no doubt the manager will be pleased with the way they're playing as a team this afternoon. Free-flowing football as they look to build down the left-hand side again. Three goals to the good now and in complete control of this game. A few of these academy players really putting on a show. What will be, for some of them, their first ever appearance for the club. Referee gives a free kick just behind the halfway line. Trying a few little skill moves there, but... The visitors come away with the ball. Now a rare glimpse of the Chippenham goal here. Held up on the right-hand side of the box, but no real support, no real urgency in their play either. They've been made and pushed back to the halfway line. Eventual cross comes in, but well dealt with back there from the Chippenham defenders who come away with the ball. Now can they mount a counter-attack of their own? They might be able to here. They've got Santos in support. They have Alfie Santos twisting, turning. Maybe going to look to get the shot away. Still with possession here, Santos. Draws in the foul, but the referee says play on. Working down the left-hand side. Chance for the cut back again. Time for as the referee blows the whistle and calls time on yet another pre-season victory for Chippenham Town. Running out 3-0 winners in the end. Siren Sester gave it a good shot. They put in a good display at home, but the Bluebirds continue their fine pre-season form and pick up another impressive win. Full time here, Sir and Sester nil, Chippenham Town 3.